I have an exciting news from Tesla Giga Berlin friends about a new long-range Tesla. Tesla has rear-wheel drive Model Y long range at Giga Berlin and it gets about 350 miles of range making it the longest range Model Y ever. It's also cheaper than the all-wheel drive Model Y. Welcome back everyone. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Tesla has released a fourth variant of the Model Y in Giga Berlin in select locations in Europe. At a rear wheel drive long range version. This gives the best of affordability and efficiency and long range due to having only a single motor. Here's all the details, friends. The price of this new Model Y is $52,500 or 48,990 euros. The motor ear rail wheel drive. The range is 372 miles WLTP, which is about 350 miles EPA, making it the longest range Model Y. Other Model Y vehicles cost and range goes follows. Rear wheel drive standard range is 282 miles and $48,200. All wheel drive long range Model Y currently is 331 miles and $59,000. Keep in mind, this is longer range and less expensive. The performance Model Y is 319 miles with $64,300. So the price of this new longest range Model Y is very comp uh, comparable to the rear wheel drive standard range. And for just a few thousand dollars more, you get about 70 miles more range. I think this is worth the extra cost personally. What do you think? Depending on your driving habits, of course. And Tesla batteries are known to last. So you can be just about certain that the battery will outlive the car to approximately 500,000 miles or more. Look my previous video on Tesla batteries. This is a great Model Y for those looking for long range, but a cheaper price than the other variants like the all-wheel drive and performance coming out of Giga Berlin. If you don't care as much about acceleration, then this Model Y is probably what you are looking for. I personally don't care about acceleration very much. Right now, this vehicle is only available in select locations across Europe and like I said it's coming from Tesla Giga Berlin however my guess is that if it is successful there is going to come to other locations around the world including the United States friends it's important to note that WLTP range which stands for worldwide harmonized light vehicles test procedure doesn't quite reflect real world range the actual range of the Model Y will likely be around 340 to 350 miles so when is this Giga Berlin long range Model Y coming to the United States? Will there be a Model 3 rear wheel drive long range? This Model Y variant should come to the United States and Tesla should also introduce a Model 3 rear wheel drive long range vehicle, says Jeremy Johnson, Torque News Tesla reporter. I will have the link in the description of this uh, report. You can see all the numbers and so please check that out, friends. Right now, the Model 3 rail-wheel drive gets 272 miles of range. This is certainly better than prior models, but those wanting range that is comparable to their gas car might be more inclined to buy if the cost were a few thousand dollars more and you got 70 to 80 miles more of range. Imagine a Model 3 rail-wheel drive long-range variant that costs $42,000 and has 350 miles of EPA range. It wouldn't be as performant as the Model 3 all-wheel drive range, but it would have great range at an affordable price. This is variant I would um, probably consider getting. Uh, do you care more about range or performance? Look for Tesla to release a Model Y rear-wheel uh, drive long range in the United States at some point. I think it's maybe coming. I also believe, says Jeremy, Tesla will release a Model 3 rear-wheel drive long range in the United States and sell it for around $42,000 with about 340 to 350 miles of range. So let me know your thoughts. What do you think about the new Model Y rear-wheel drive long range? Would you get this vehicle if it was available in the United States, if you are in the United States, or if this was available in your location, if you are in, loca in that location. I have to say that I'm pretty much impressed how well Tesla is doing at Giga Berlin and Giga Texas. We don't hear much about the Fremont factory, how things are going well, but you know, a lot of things are coming. A lot of vehicles, of course, are coming from Tesla's Fremont factory. 
but Giga Berlin has done very well. Now we hear that Tesla CEO Elon Musk is also meeting Argentine pre uh, president and uh, looks like something is coming up with India. Do you think Tesla by the end of the year will announce two new Giga factories in Argentina and in India? And let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Friends, this is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please visit us at TorqueNews.com for more Tesla electric vehicles and automotive news in general. Give us thumbs up for this video if you found the information interesting and I'll bring you more. God bless you and I'll see you soon in our next report. Come back a little bit later for a new electric vehicle report.